Hi, this is my first YouTube video and these are my favorite products that I'm using right now. I used a voiceover recording process to um, do my voice because the camera didn't pick it up very well. So first we're going to get started with the Benefit Boing Concealer. I use this under my eyes and it is awesome. Next is a blush by Lil Rock and the color is exposed and it's the Baked Matte Satin Blush. And it's um, a pink, shimmery, pinky peach, shimmery color. I put it on the apples of my cheeks and it gives me a nice healthy glow. I love it. Next, MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Soft and Gentle. This is my highlight color. Um, I put it on the top of my cheekbones after I put on my blush. It is beautiful. Next is the MAC Blotting Powder. And the color I use in this is light. And I use this to finish my foundation. Only takes a little bit. Also, um, throughout the day, you can use it to kind of freshen up your complexion, uh, freshen up your foundation, I mean. Next is my favorite foundation of all time. This is the Estee Lauder Double Wear Powder Foundation. And I love it. Um, it's, my color is Shell, and it's a medium to full coverage foundation. And the reason why they call it double wear is because it lasts all day. Like, it's kind of almost like that powder version of Revlon Colors Day liquid foundation. You put it on in the morning, it looks the same in the afternoon and the evening. It's awesome. Next is a blush by MAC. And this blush is called Harmony. Sorry, my camera's not focusing. <laughs> But it's um, kind of a, a brownish with purple, pink undertones. Um, I use it as my bronzer because I have very fair skin and bronzer looks weird on me sometimes. Next is a blush by Corez. And this blush is a peach blush. Number 18 peach. And it's good for fall, winter. Next, liquid foundation. Revlon Color Stay. Um, my color is ivory. This just is like a second skin. It really, um, it's really nice. It will last all day. But it really is only medium coverage. Um, it's not full coverage at all. The people that say it is full coverage, maybe you can build it up to full coverage, but I only like to put one layer on. Uh, next is MAC Studio Fix Fluid in NC15. And I love this. Um, mostly I wear my Estee Lauder every day, but, um, but I wear this when I wear liquid foundation. I spent an extra five bucks on the pump, which I highly recommend, otherwise you get waste. Um, it has better coverage than the Revlon Color Stay. It just doesn't last as long. So that's really my only complaint on this one. Next is a brush cleanser by Sephora. It's the daily brush cleanser. And you don't use this one at the sink. You, um take your brushes and you just spritz the end of your brush and then you um, wipe your brush on some tissue to clean it and you don't have to rinse it off which is great. Next is a MAC lipstick in faux. Sorry that my camera is not focusing there. But this is a gorgeous dark pink nude color is the best way I can just describe it. I got it because it looks a lot like my natural lip color and it just kind of gives you a really nice finished look on your lips. <clears throat> it's a satin lipstick.
Next is the Neutrogena Moisture Shine in Sheer Buck. And this is a frosty nude color. I almost wish it wasn't so frosty, but it's not like super frosty, but no. <clears throat> Next is Makeup Forever HD Micro Finishing Powder. And it's just white silica powder. Um, this was 30 bucks for 10 grams. So if you can find white silica powder, it's probably going to be cheaper than this. But this is good for finishing your makeup. You can also give yourself a touch up during the day and it'll look like you just put your makeup on. Next, this is L'Oreal Bare Natural Concealer. This is the best concealer I've ever used, like for blemishes and marks on your face and stuff. First, you know, you put on your foundation, my Estee Lauder, um, <clears throat> and then you follow with the concealer, followed by the blot powder. And your face will look flawless. Like, get this, it's all. Next is Philosophy Hope in a Jar Foundation, um, not foundation, blah, moisturizer. It is awesome for winter. Next, uh, Neutrogena Visibly Even Daily Moisturizer SPF 30. Awesome for year-round, awesome for summer. Um, it will even out your complexion so you don't have to use as much makeup. Next, I got the Clinique 3-Step System. This is the Mild Liquid Facial Cleansing. Um, my skin has been so clear since I got this, seriously. Uh, second step is the Mild Clarifying Lotion. Um, this one's for very dry, delicate skin. Even though I don't have very dry, delicate skin, I got this because I don't like how toners irritate my skin. And this has been amazing. Like, all my acne bumps are gone. Next is Urban Decay Book of Shadows Volume 2. I have no desire to get the Alice palette because this is amazing enough. And I use it every day. Next, da dun da dun Clarisonic. I love it. I use it every day. My skin is so soft and so smooth. That says so fresh and so clean. You know, like the song, so fresh and so clean, clean. Anyway, <laughs> um, I got the Delicate Brush Head. It cleans just as well as the other brush heads, but it's really gentle. Um, it has two speeds. I love it for every day. All right, so that was my video of my favorite products right now. Um, stay tuned for more videos. Bye.